top 3 ghosts trapped on video. Hello folks all over the world, I would like to clarify a video that is shooting on many channels that deal with the paranormal, it is a video on social TikTok where we see two children on the carousel sitting on a spaceship, but when the carousel makes a turn one of the children disappears. First of all it is the same spaceship because we see that in front of them there are two girls with Gwerka and behind them there is a ship with only one child. In reality, if we look closely there is nothing paranormal, it is yet another fake video passed off as real, but we immediately see that at the feet of the children's, there is a series of blue LED strips, while on the next round of the carousel, one of the child is hidden in the pedals of the carry cart, effectively obscuring the strips, and indeed when the carry cart moves away, we can see that the child standing is talking to someone crouched on the pedal board. My not very imaginary friend. In previous episodes we have often talked about children and the paranormal. The story we are about to tell takes place in the town of Masontown, in Pennsylvania, where Jennifer, her husband and three-year-old son Caleb, recently bought a an home and moved into the new house, built in the early 1960s. But Jennifer immediately starts noticing oddities, the dog doesn't want to go upstairs, he is always scared and barks often and his son Caleb claims to see a monster with feminine features. Where's the monster? Jennifer initially did not give importance to the claims of little Caleb, thinking that he was an imaginary friend. In the comments to the video, someone recommended that she try the GhostTube SLS app, a mobile app for identifying humanoid bodies in the environment, similar to the SLS Connect cameras used by real paranormal investigators, and Jennifer posts a really disturbing video. Help! Okay. KK's room. The mother begins to fear that there is an intruder because the little Caleb describes the monster as a not ugly being so she decides to take the camera to interview the child. I hear the song. I hear the song. Is your friend still here? Mm -hmm. Is your friend still here? Why are you in the tunnel? In the tunnel? What's she doing in the tunnel? I said I not hear. Do you hear a plane? I hear the airplane. Uh, no, helicopter. Helicopter. Where is your friend? In the tunnel? Huh? You said your friend's in the tunnel? What color is your friend? Blue. She's blue? Yeah, he's blue. He's blue. Jennifer thinks back to her son's phrases, a blue female monster who lives in the tunnel, but there are no tunnels in her house so she speculates that it could be a long, narrow closet that the child would see as a tunnel. But it was during a moving night when Jennifer was left alone with her son, that things become creepy. Caleb insisted on going up and looking for the blue monster upstairs so the mother decides to follow him and turns on the camera. Is it in there? Is the monster in there? Where's the monster? What? What? It's in Caden's room. Go check it. Go check the monster. Go check on the monster? Yeah. I don't want to do that. What? What does the monster look like? Oh God, no. I fired her. What? I fired her. I'm coming, Mr. 
But Jennifer didn't notice that towards the end of this video, you hear a very disturbing EVP that some users have pointed out in the comments, let's listen to it again. Oh god, no. What? A disturbing male voice seems to utter some words in a pained tone, declaring that he is not a monster. After viewing numerous user comments regarding these EVPs, Jennifer discovers a hidden grave in the garden of the new home. You can follow Jennifer's future updates on her TikTok channel to find out if she can shed some light on this disturbing story. Unexpected Manifestations most people have never had anything to do with the paranormal. Sometimes, however, someone who changes his life, changes house, finds himself in places where some energy begins to reveal itself. This is the case of James, a 30-year-old father of a little girl who with his wife and daughter recently moved to the state of Utah, USA in an apartment building, whose adjoining apartments were recently abandoned for unknown reasons. From the earliest days James and his family begin to hear and see bizarre things in their home. Posted in November 5, 2019 on his TikTok channel titled James Fitzpatrick 18, the video shows a footage taken by James while he was in the living room. That toy car is moving by itself. In some comments, some speculate that it could be signal interference from neighbors but as explained, James and his family are the only tenants of an apartment complex, abandoned by some renters recently. James and his family also experience strange noises in the night and objects moving on their own as documented in some videos. In this footage James films the dog behaving in an unusual way while pointing at his daughter's bedroom, and the child was absent because she is a guest in her parents' house for safety. James says oddities also show up at work, whenever he's alone in the evening. During a shift, all the alarms start to sound so he decides to shoot the scene with the phone and manages to film this. Jesus Christ. The fuck, everything's going all fucking haywire. We got alarms going off, fucking Ryan's out on fucking patrol. Look, there's a fucking poltergeist or some shit in here. Oh, fuck that! Oh, no, 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 fuck this. Holy shit. No fucking way did that just fucking happen. Fucking. No fucking way. No fucking shit did that just fucking happen. Holy shit. What the fuck? Fuck. James visibly terrified can't explain when it happened. In the comments, several users declares that in the state of Utah these events often occur, and the locals live with them. The Abandoned House This time we move to Brazil, precisely in the seaside city of Recife, well-known Brazilian tourist resort where Alan, a paranormal investigator together with his friends, well known for being excellent urban explorers, visit an abandoned house in the area late at night known by the locals to be heavily infested. Right from the start the boys agree in feeling a very heavy energy that envelopes the whole house and some of them even claim to feel observed. Published on April 27, 2020 on Alan's official YouTube channel, entitled Procura Sobrenatural, the video shows the exploration inside the house and the cameras manage to capture something truly inexplicable. Boa noite, tem alguém aí? Boa noite, hein? Oh. Tem alguém aí? 
Tem alguém por aí dormindo aí? E aí, vamos entrar? Tô com a sensação que tem alguém aí dentro. Oi! Upon arriving at the scene, one of them films the front door of the house, but notices that there is something strange in the door. When the boys review the images they are petrified, a very tall translucent female figure seems to observe them from the door of the house. Oh, boa noite. Licença. Tem alguém por aí dormindo aí? The house inside is in a dilapidated state, broken bricks, damaged furniture and the boys are detecting strong signals from the K2 continuous but do not get answers to their questions with the spirit box. However, once again a shot of the exterior of the house, frames a dark shadow in the first floor window. In the comments, users congratulate the group for the seriousness with which they have undertaken this urban exploration. As you know, however, the web continues to fill up with fake videos in the paranormal scene like the video posted on the TikTok channel by this woman, showing a doll moving without electric batteries inside. Actually the video doesn't show the whole doll and we know it's easy to put the batteries on the other side of the doll's dress, and power them to get a shock effect similar to this video. Dear friends, our episode ends here, if you want to thank us for the video leave a like or a comment to help us in our work, I thank you for your attention, I always give you an appointment on our social network channels and of course we will see you next time, to the next episode, good night.